you and I should meet for a butterbeer soon. Are you asking me on a date? No. No! I'm leaving! Ha! I feel fine. And it will do me good to Whoa, see oh. friend. What just happened? Um, wait, what? Know, mother. What? I just jumped on her and then she just... Good to see you, my friend. Passed out almost. But... What? Turn me in. Oh! Um... Oh! Turn me in. I'm just, I'm just over here b breaking stuff. Whatever oh. lies ahead, we must face it together. Look at this. That look at I this, know. Ominous. Look, look. I'm going up and down for no reason. It's like an elevator that's pointless. Aw, oh, Figgy Puddin died. Or he's asleep. What a wonderful place for a nap. What's up, y'all? This is Trav Nan, and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy, where we're getting pretty close to being done. Last episode, we just did some side missions. If y'all enjoying this series, make sure to give it a like, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get into it. So let's see. Let's go talk to Natty and take down Harlow. I have no idea. I forgot who Harlow is, but uh, Poppy wants to meet me in the Great Hall. Okay, we'll meet Poppy real quick, and then we'll go to Natty. Why does everybody want to meet over here by the fireplace? Where we have food. Just the person I was hoping to see. No, you're not the person I was hoping to see. I see Doran finally convinced you to leave the Snidgets. If anyone can keep them out of poacher hands, it's the Centaurs. And I wanted to thank you. When the poachers ambushed us, I... It was nice not to face them alone. I just like taking out people. I was happy to help a friend. Of course. It's the sort of thing friends do for each other, isn't it? I suppose so to annihilate poachers. Great pastime with friends. I wouldn't want to repeat of Hauntel Hall, of course, but I did enjoy the three broomsticks. Had no idea you like getting drunk, man. Poppy likes to get drunk and take out poachers in her for four foot. And well, I don't know how Serona feels about hippogriffs popping in for a butterbeer. Highwing's the only one I would have gone with. Or Gran, of course. Highwing's good company. Nothing wrong with that. Highwing's good company. She is. Although I am beginning to see the appeal of her uh, human friends. It was nice to talk about my parents and Gran with someone. And share Highwing. Uh, have you heard from your parents? I don't suppose you've heard anything from your parents, have you? I haven't, but I'm perfectly fine with that. Did you tell your Gran we found the Snidgets? Does your Gran know that we found the Snidgets? I couldn't hold it in any longer. I told her everything. <gasps> you did. She was livid that I'd been anywhere near the poachers. But she confessed that she was rather envious about the Snidgets. All right. Stay out of trouble. It has all been a pleasure, Poppy. Do try and stay out of trouble. Don't know that I can. We've taken on poachers twice now, successfully. I rather think you've helped me develop a taste for it. That's kind of creepy. And with creepy. as allies, I might actually go looking for trouble. You and I should meet for a butterbeer soon. Are Perhaps Highwing can join us? Are you asking me on a date? No. No! I'm leaving! Alright, now let's go meet up with uh, Natty to take down Harlow. I feel like with Avada Kedavra that I should really use that sparingly. Because I can't have it as a, re as a regular spell because it takes so long to recharge. But I'll be like one of those, if I face a troll, then I'll use it. We're here. And of course she's not here because they're always late. Oh, she wanted to do this at night. Kind of devious, Natty. I'm ready to finish Harlow once and for all. What is your plan? I received an owl from Mrs. Bickle. She wondered if we were having any luck going after Harlow. Suggested we could gather evidence from a friend near Manor Cape. Oh, I thought I was she getting a cape. That was the Manor Cape. Was rather adamant about it. I don't care Precisely. what she thinks. Harlow knows that we saved Archie. And that we rescued Mr. Rabe. The letter didn't come from Mrs. Bickle, did it? I do not believe it did. Harlow intends to ambush us. But now we have the upper hand. We can prepare. We are stronger than Harlow, and he knows it. I can't remember That's who Harlow is. Resorting to this sort of trickery. We must go. I'm ready. Agreed. Let's finish this. Brilliant. Harlow's reign ends today. Perhaps um, we ought okay. to inform Officer oh. Singer of our plans. I already sent her an owl to let her know that we were following a lead given to us by Mrs. Bickle. Will she join us she might in this? In these festivities? Indeed, she will. But so be it. I am tired of hiding it from her. My mother needs to understand that I will not be safe from the Ashwinders until everyone is. I shall pursue them until they are finished. And I think she knows that. As do you. That I do. Wait, wh where is this taking me? What? Keep an eye ah. out. Halo is likely around here somewhere. I sense he is close. 
Where is he? I do not know. There they are. They here they are. Come on. I, I just got done with the big battle versus the poachers. Now I'm doing these guys. Okay. You're done. Oh, hold on. Hold on, rolling around the ground. Not sure why there's an there's an blah, 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 blah. Not sure why there's an infery here. That's the best. Gotcha. No, you don't. Okay. Nope. Hold on. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Now it's just you. Oh. Okay. Oh, you want to go up there? All right. All right. Gotcha. Okay. Now what? Oh. Wait, who's expulsing you mean right for a cussing? Wait. Little Nat Sionai, in it? And her excruciating. I don't remember who Harlow was. So this is Harlow. Companion. You two have done quite a bit of damage to my business interests. <laughs> but I must gradually give you some credit. What was once a mere annoyance has become remarkably problematic. Fortunately, I pride myself on my problem-solving skills. Hmm. You look like you're just holding a regular stick. Hold on, let me do this. Let me see if I can kill him one shot. Okay, he's, okay, he's done. Oh. <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, wait. Oh. I, see, I, I, I didn't think it was going to be that easy. Oh, wait, well, I guess it was. When Avada Kedavra, and that was it. Well, except I used on him, but he didn't die, so I'm confused by the spell. Oh, Singer's here. Wait, she can't survive one Crucio spell, but these guys can survive it multiple times? Does that mean she doesn't have to do her homework now? Oh, okay, so she's fine. Are you sure you are up for a visitor? Yes, mother. Huh. I feel fine, and it will do me good to Whoa. see a friend. What just happened? Um, <laughs> wait, what? Know, mother. What? <laughs> I just jumped on her and then she just good to see you, my friend. passed out almost. What the heck? Glad to see you're doing so well. I just pushed your mom out of the chair. Than it appears. I am only here because my mother insisted just to be safe. I was relieved when she told me that you were alright. 
Thanks to you. Only because of you. How are you feeling? <laughs> well, I've had better days. But Nurse Blaney says that I am on the mint. I'm sorry, Natty. It's my fault you got hurt. What? No. Do not blame yourself for this. The moment that I saw Harlow aim his wand at you, well... This one. You quickly made the choice to protect me. I did what I had to, and I would do it again. I but why did you change into an animal before then? Why can't you just do it then I in human guilty. form? Of course not. There was nothing that you... Oh. Oh my. I cannot believe that it took me this long to see it. What? He made a choice. Based on instinct, my father, you, my friend, are no more to blame for my injuries today than I am to blame for my father's sacrifice years ago. From what I know of him, it seems there's a lot of your father in you. That's very kind of you to say. I hope that you are right. This has all been a bit much, hasn't it? Taking down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot. But we have done it. Rookwood is dead, Harlow is on his way to Azkaban, and the rest of them are on the run. I still don't see how he survived a about a cadaver. About. That doesn't make Thank any sense. I thought it was a killing course. curse. Why is he but not dead? Rookwood's enterprise has fallen apart. How did he live? Everything is safer now because of us. Because of you. Thank you, but we make a formidable team. You, my fellow traveler, have enriched my time at Hogwarts beyond anything I could have imagined. By putting your life Thank in you. danger. I believe ah, your friendship. That's what every school experience needs. Thank you for coming to visit me. Okay, bye. It's always good to see you. Let me knock your mom over again. Okay, well, she doesn't want to be knocked over, so. Can I steal stuff? Oh, there's a letter over here. A quit Quidditch injury record. Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry Hospital Wing. Attending healer, Nurse Noreen Bailey. Patient name, redacted by order of Professor Black. Age, redacted by order of Professor Black. Notes. The patient was injured during a Quidditch match, though, in my professional opinion, a redacted by order of Professor, Professor Black hardly counts as an injury. In fact, if anyone was injured, it was me, as I do not believe I've ever rolled my eyes quite so hard in my life. It is a wonder I can even see to write this note. Rather unbelievably, or indeed despicably, the headmaster now wants to cancel Quidditch, all because of pure blood redacted by order of Professor Black, when Ant redacted by order of Professor Black, before the snitch was even in sight. When I pressed the headmaster slightly, I was told redacted by order of Professor Black. Staggering. Ah, makes so much sense now. Let's go all the gag with Sebastian. Sebastian, there you are. She's devastated. She just buried your uncle alone. Who? I did it for her. Oh, Anne. Sebastian. Anne can't bear the thought of turning you in, but... What? Turn me in? Oh! Um... I'll give you some time to think, Sebastian. Oh! I'm just, I'm just over here b breaking stuff. Oh, I'm trying to talk to you while in the air. But Sebastian, did you hear that? No. You saw what happened. I never wanted to hurt my uncle. I know. I can't believe he's gone. How did things go so wrong? I didn't mean it. I didn't mean to. But you just said about it, whatever, oh, you have um, to mean it. I was only trying to help. I can't leave now. Anne needs me more than ever. You understand. You can talk to Ominous. Make him understand. He listens to you. I need to be with Anne. Uh, fine. Don't worry, Sebastian. I shall speak with Ominous. Thank you. You're a good friend, truly. Am I? No I haven't been enabling. Because I want to learn some I'm spells. Glad we met. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, Ominous. Ominous. <laughs> Let me talk from you from behind this. I can't believe Barrel. it. After I last saw you, I went straight to Hogwarts. Before I had time oh. to talk to Black, I heard from Anne. I rushed to Feldcroft and found her with Solomon's body. She was beside herself with grief. Part of her wants Sebastian to face the consequences, another part can't bear the thought of it. I don't want to lose Sebastian, but I don't think we have a choice. We do have a choice. What good will it do to turn him in now? He clearly regrets everything. He's not going to do anything like this again. We've both heard that before. But we also need to think about Anne. She's lost her health. Now she's lost her uncle. Do you really want to take her brother away from her too? I... I understand what you're saying. Perhaps you're right. As much as I believe that Sebastian should pay for his actions. 
We'd only be punishing Anne as well. I hope we're doing the right thing. I don't even know the right thing it is anymore. I just if want to move on with my life. With this decision. Thank you, Ominous. You're a good friend. Whatever oh. lies ahead, we must face it together. Look at this. That look at this, will. Ominous. Look, look. I'm going up and down for no reason. It's like an elevator that's pointless. All right, can't dilly dally anymore. Let's go finish this thing, jig the final repository. F Figgy Pudding has been waiting for about a week in game time now, so he should be ready. What is that? What is this? Huh. What is that? Why is it? Uh, what that? Okay, fine. You ready, Fig? I forgot what we're doing. Oh, me cool music's playing now. I hope that the enchantments protecting the castle would protect against an incursion from below. I fear they may not. Although, if they don't now, I can assure you, they will in the future. Were you able to reach Professor Weasley? I was. Hopefully she and the others will arrive soon. They know where to find the door through which we enter. They should have arrived already. I mean, I've been gone for a week before this, uh, the last time we did this mission. Damn, the goblins. Dang it, the goblins are here. Let's go. Okay, I'll follow you. Run. Run, Fig, run. You can't you can't rock in a cool if montage. Here, you gotta fight people. Far behind. You and I have faced worse, Professor. Take down the goblins. Nope. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay, I can't see. Hey, hey. Okay, let me get out of here. I can't, they're too close, I can't see anything. Ah. Okay, hold on. Oh, hold on. They keep getting so close to me. Oh. Too many goblins are showing up. Starting to steal my frames. Ah. Okay, y'all are getting like way too close. Not today, Buckaroo. Nope. Trying to focus on one guy and they. Oh, there he goes. But they keep jumping in front of me. Alright. We need to press on. Ranrock must be here somewhere. This dream okay. stands between us and him. We need to move it. I shall handle it. One okay. Let's go. Let's go. I, I'll say it. If there's a troll in here, I'll use my Avada Kedavra. Aha! Predicted. Hold on, hold on. There's two trolls in here. Oh, God. Okay, got that one. No. Wait, 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 wait. Gotcha. Okay. Now works better. Oh. Ow. Hold on now. Okay. Gotcha. Whoa. Wait, are you chasing me now? Oh, okay, you are. Oh, gosh. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Let me switch spells again. They just finished recharging. 
Hold on, ow, hold on. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Bro. Leave me alone. Oh. Alright, now we can take him down. Um. Do I have to wait for it to wear off? Or. I guess I could just do this. Wait. There. That works. Now what? Is it? Professor, that wall, that's the way forward. Oh. Very perceptive. Ah. Young friend. It worked. Let's go. Why are you Lumosing? Like, I can clearly see in here. It's not that dark. I feel you're right, Professor. There's nothing we can Wait, I need a wiggle. There we go. Listen, more goblins up ahead. An intruder! Gotcha. Where am I? Oh. Okay, that works. Oh, okay, there's more of them. Gotcha. Okay, we're good now. These tunnels haven't brought us much luck so far. My gl my gear slots are full. Ah! Dang it! Full of so much useless junk. Oh, that that's why, Professor. We're getting closer, Professor. That oh, wait. What? You ready? Oh man, there's two trolls here. Ah, this sucks. What well, actually, or does it? Oh, look at that. This is like the Avengers thing. Ho ho! The whole school's coming. Can I use my unforgivable curse here without being suspended in the middle of the fight? Oh. Sweet. Not gonna lie. Gives me those Avengers Endgame vibes. Let's go. Also, can't hear a thing. It's so loud. Goodbye. Let's go, Professor. Okay, now we're here. Now what? Nope.
I mean, there's a bunch of professors around, so they're all gonna be mad at me now. Ah! Why is there a reticle on? I don't know. Oh, okay, I turned it off. We're, we're good now. Apparently I press R3 next to Oh, come here. Gotcha. Gotcha. Look out! Another troll! This one's worse than the last two! Is it? Gotcha! Hey, there's a presser down here. There he goes. Another troll, man. I just. How many of these do they have? Uh oh. Nice catch! That's how we forward. Drop it on the goblins. Oh no. You use it as a bridge. That's a lot, that, okay, that's a lot smarter. That's why you're the professor. Oh, goodbye. You can't come. Only cool people can come this way. Pretty quiet over here. Okay. Oh. No, 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 no. We're we're on your side. Oh, jeez. Do I need a, a bot a cadaver one of these? I oh, wonder if I can control one of these guys. The one. Quickly. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot I had a one still. Yeah, just stop. Oh, that was easy. We made it. I'm relieved we got here before Ranrock. Did we? I can't believe this is it. The repository has been under the castle for hundreds of years. Think of all the pain that created it. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. 
what Isadora showed you. You are now the keeper of whatever power it holds. What do you intend to do with it? Take over the world! Uh, I think we should keep it contained here. I plan to leave the repository as it is. I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking. What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her and the others sooner. Trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? I shall keep it a secret for now. I plan to keep it secret for now. But in time, when I am ready, I plan to tell those I trust everything and accept their help. I believe that is what Miriam would have wanted. We should trust in others. If anyone can rise to this challenge, my friend, it is you. Time to face Ranrock now. The arrogance of wizard kind. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to us. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Miriam's wand. If she'd simply handed over the container, all of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. <laughs> Seems you were too kind. She didn't know when to give up either. <laughs> Well, I was going to keep it contained, but I guess not. Ranrock had other ideas. A dragon now? I'm confused. How do we fight a dragon that's made up of evil? Oh, am I supposed to dive something here? Where are you at? He's feeding off the power from the repository. <laughs> Your beautiful magic is no match for mine, child! Yeah, I don't know what to do. Oh, what? Oh. Yeah, yeah. 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 Ow. Hold on now. Owie. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Drink your good wake belt. Oh wait, are those homing missiles? Okay, hold on, I'm gonna get it. Some weird mechanics. Oh, okay, I'm not gonna get it at all. Okay, I got that one. Okay, no, I can block that one. Okay, I, I'm, I'm gonna get it. Nope, okay. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, you wanna bite down here now? Okay. Coming! Oh! 
Okay, I'm, okay, I'm here. Yeah, I'm missing, but... Wait, is there a thing? Is there a thing? Oh, let's so come down there more. Okay. You are very complicated to defeat, sir. Oops, I missed. Shoot. Ah, oh, shoot, I missed it. Okay, ow. Dang it. Come on, come on. Whoa, oh, ah, uh, shoot. I'm good, I'm good. I don't know why I couldn't dodge that. Ah, shoot. Ready. So I, I don't want to jump down there. I'm gonna die. Uh, okay, I'm stuck. Am I supposed to jump down there? That just seems like a bad idea. Okay. Okay, no. Do I, do I go down this way? Oh yes. Okay. You can't run forever, Man Rock. Where you at? There you are. Whoa, no, no. Ah, I missed. It's so far away. Okay, I'm trying to reach there, but I can't. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. Ah, shoot. Can't block this. Can't 
Okay. It's kind of hard. Only 16 wagon welds. Arrest the momentum. Ah, I, I, I didn't take a chance there. Accio. No, Accio that. Ah, oh, shoot. Ah. No, come on, let me dodge. There you go. Arrest <laughs> ah! There's a third one. There it is. Nope. Ah. Okay. Fifteen wagon welts. Ah, shoot. How do I access my items? Ah. Okay. Ah. Okay, hold on. Oh gosh. Okay, it's all the way over there. Shoot. Dang it, I can't get over there. Okay, it's right here. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Got it. Ah! Okay, why am I... I'm not trying... I'm gonna dodge, but he keeps... Can I get this? Okay, I got a wiggle weld. What? He wasn't looking at me. Dang it, I use it. Okay, I got run number. I couldn't move out of the way. He's too big. Ah! There we go. Come on. Ah! Nope, move it. There we go. Dodge! Dang it, I can't dodge all the way out of the way. Run, dude, run, 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 run. Okay, I can't use it right now. Ha! Ah! Finally got it. Ah, ah. Got it. Ah, shoot. I'm stuck. Can't see a thing. Come on. No. Ah, freak. Drink your wiggle well, sir. Stop. Stop doing your whatever you're doing. Ah, cha.
Okay, ow. Run this way, run, 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 dirt. I don't know why he stops running sometimes. Okay, I'm trying to move, but he doesn't want to run sometimes. Ah! Gotcha! Come on! You are a tough cookie. What, what are you doing now? Ow. I can't attack you right now. Gotcha. Oh. Ah. Got it. You can't see me! I mean, he clearly can, but... I think we did it. Hey, Big's back. Professor. I'm trying. I well, I'm, actually, I'm not trying anything right now. Right, I'm almost max level in this game. Well, that was easy. Professor. Miriam. Although you could change up your look, you look ridiculous. Aw, oh, Figgy Puddin' died. Or he's asleep. What a wonderful place for a nap. Just a regular day at school. Professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was a beloved professor to many of you, certainly a long-standing colleague to his peers. A famed adventurer and seeker of knowledge, he built a reputation... charging into the unknown, brazenly disregarding both discretion and safety, providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled only by his dedication to Hogwarts. And of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. Um, <clears throat> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 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 
Professor Fig represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever, possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind, and was the most loyal of friends. But perhaps it was his remarkable courage for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig, well, I can say with confidence. He was never in his classroom, him, though. After, after a while, I mean, I don't think he. I think he taught one class. Would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him. Why, why am I all shaky? <laughs> I'm, I'm so nervous. Wisely, resourcefully. Justly and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig. I thought I changed the the Great Hall to show only Gryffindor. What happened to that? We'll never know. Can't believe we lost Fig. I didn't know him as well as you did, but I know he was a good man. Glad Weasley spoke for him. She honored him well. Fig will be well remembered. I wish the same could have been done for my uncle. I wonder if there's a chance Anne would meet me. Sebastian. I can't imagine what you and Anne are going through. Perhaps you'll hear from her soon. I hope so. I... I'll let you know. Sebastian, there's something you should know. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if he faced quite a fight. The rumors are true, and I did. But it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Children should be seen and not heard. Wait, what, what are you saying? It wasn't one of Ranrock's loyalists who cursed Anne. It was Rookwood. It was Rookwood all along. This, this can't be. It was the loyalists. It's always been them. The night Anne was cursed, all she saw were goblins. Once Rookwood allied with Ranrock, Isadora's estate became of interest to them both. That's why Rookwood was there the night Anne was cursed. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw your sister, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her. And she's never been the same. So cruel. Rookwood deserved what he got. Thank you for telling me. It wasn't a goblin. I suppose I owe you I mean, we can still, like, take down goblins. goblins. Those are the enemy. But it was never that simple. Ominous like if they had red eyes, then that, that, that means they're I evil. She'll see me. I'll find out and send word when I know more. I, you don't have to. I honestly don't care. Just another day at Hogwarts. Oh, back in the con room. So now what? Now we'll find out. What to do? Man, my cape keeps getting messed up. Oh, congratulations, you've completed the story of Hogwarts Legacy and reached the end of your school year. With your owl exams fast approaching, now's a good time to review your field guide progress, explore the world, finish any remaining relationship storylines, and side quests, and complete your field guide as you see fit. Oh. I've thought about what you told me in the Great Hall. I would like to speak with you. Meet me in the Undercross as soon as you can. Why not just come talk to me? All right, so that'll do it for this episode. We may have another episode where I just do a bunch of random side quests, but we've done the main story quest line. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If y'all did enjoy it, make sure to leave a like on this video and comment down below of how you thought the story was. Uh, I probably ruined some uh, moments because that's how we do. And if y'all enjoy my channel, don't forget to, to subscribe. And I'll see y'all next time.